Eddie Hall, um, Britain's strongman, has been in with the BBC crew Inside Out, doing some filming so that they can look at a variety of fitness tests and see what he's like in terms of comparing himself with other people. So his strength, his power, his body composition, his energy expenditure, those kind of things. And what we're looking at is different facets of human performance that we can measure in the labs. We've looked at his uh, jump height performance on a force plate. And with the jump height, what we can assess is the efficiency of his utilization of the muscles in his legs primarily. So hopefully, with the jump height figures, we can then uh, inform his training to get him in, you know, better at different parts of his event. This is the first time I've probably tested somebody with so much power and so much muscle. So usually you'll have your athlete coming in, but it'll be your rugby player or even your martial arts type person. But still, there's no comparison. You know, the results he was getting on some of those tests were just phenomenal. We also had a look at uh, his energy expenditure and we found out that he was expending about 5,000 calories and that was just at rest. So this is quite useful for finding out how much he actually needs to eat if he does completely nothing. And then we'd have to double that score to find out how much he should be eating on a daily basis. And we got that around 10,000 calories, which is exactly what he he eats so it, some of these tests often confirm what's already happening but every now and again you can pick up things that you say oh that's not quite right uh, it's been good it's been interesting um, the best thing I'm going to take away from today is is how much it takes to actually fuel a body my size you know I had no idea it's going to take sort of 5,000 calories just to sit on uh, on a sofa all day you know uh, it takes 5,000 calories so I now know all the, all the food, you know, when it, the days when I miss a meal and I don't hit 10,000 calories, I know I'm hindering my training. So I need to be on point with my food, you know, and that's made me realise it even more.